understand about sequences. Assume that there is a generation gap of 30 years. We are asked to find the number of ancestors that is parents, grandparents, great grandparents etc that a person might have over 300 years. Here the total number of generations equals to 300 by 30 that is 10. Let the number of people for the first, second, third and similarly 10th generation are 2, 4, 8 and up to 1024. These form of numbers are called sequence. The various number occurring in a sequence are called its terms. We denote the terms of a sequence by A1, A2, A3 and similarly A10. The subscripts denote the position of the terms. Sequence can be of two types infinite sequence and finite sequence. Finite sequence has finite number of terms that is these terms can be counted. On the other hand infinite sequence has infinite number of terms. The number of terms in this sequence cannot be counted. Series. Let A1, A2, A3 and so on till An form a given sequence. Then we have A1 plus A2 plus A3 plus A4 and so on till An. This is called a series associated to that sequence. Sum of series. Sum of all the terms of a series is called sum of series. It is represented by Sn equals to A1 plus A2 plus A3 and so on till An.